Hey, what's up everybody? It's Allsec Pride here back with a tutorial video on how to properly clean your laptop. Now, um, everybody has their different ways on how to do it, but this, this method is the safest and it gets the job done the best. And what I mean by safest is um, most people, their cleaner that they use is Windex or something that's ammonia or alcohol based. Now basically what alcohol and ammonia will do over time is if you apply it to your screen, it'll erode at your screen and in a couple of years um, the display is going to look really really bad. So um, stay away from cleaners that have ammonia and alcohol in it. I really recommend iClear, it's a great great um, solution and you know it's just really popular, very good for products. and. You know, just any any electronic cleaner is fine, but I really recommend iClear, and I'll leave their link in the description box so you guys can check them out. Now, the second thing is um, people use like paper towels or tissues, and the problem with that is the surface on the paper towel is really rough. So, you know, when you're cleaning away at your laptop, you're gonna leave little scratches um, into your display. So that's really bad. So what you want to what you're gonna uh, use is a microfiber cloth or lint-free cloth. You know, just some kind of cloth. Um, I really re recommend microfiber because the fibers can really just get into um, the screen and just wipe away all the dirt and, and grime uh, that's on there. So the products you're going to be needing is, of course, a cloth, some cleaner that doesn't have uh, ammonia or alcohol in it, and some compressed air. Um, as you can see right here, I just have some dust remover, which is just, you know, um, compressed air. Basically, you can find this at any electronics store or Walmart, and we're just going to be using this to blow out all the, you know, food dust or hair, whatever, collected into my keyboard or into the little cracks and crevices. So there you go. So first thing you're going to want to do is, like I said, um, just, uh, you know, just flow into the keyboard and do a little short, quick burst. Don't hold on to the button for too long or turn, up, turn it upside down. That will actually release this um, gas form of this and it's like ice. It can give you like, um, it can give you frostbite and it's really not good for your um, computer. So just do a little short, quick burst. And I'm doing it pretty quick, quick um, but you know, you, you're gonna wanna take your time on that and just get into the little cracks and crevices. And um, you also wanna spray um, the air at your screen. Just if there's anything stuck on there, you're not gonna wanna take a cloth and just, you know, wipe your screen and just leave a big scratch over it. So you just wanna um, knock off anything that can be stuck to your screen. So there you go. And um, now you're gonna wanna get your cloth and just fold it into fourths. So there we go, we got it like that. And get your clean, cleaner, um, again, iClear. And you're not gonna wanna, you're not gonna wanna spray your laptop directly. What that will do is, um, that could drip down into your circuit board and fry everything. So you don't wanna just um, spray it into your cloth and two, three sprays should do the job just fine. So we we'll just get the laptop into the picture more and just hold the back of your display and don't apply too much pressure. Just um, gently go from side to side, up and down and in a circular manner. So there you go. Now again, take your time on this. I'm just doing it um, quickly for the sake of keeping this video relatively short. But just try to get all the fingerprints and um, dust or whatever accumulated on the screen off. So there you go. And um, also just um, since we've already, you know, um, blown at the keyboard with the compressed air, just knock off all the grime that um, is at the surface right now. And just clean the sides and your trackpad. So there you go. And just close your laptop. There we go. And you can choose to clean um, the surface of it. At this point, it's fine if you just spray directly on to the laptop. And um, there you go. Just again, clean it in a circular motion. It's the best. 
and it'll it'll do the best uh, job at cleaning. So now that we have that clean, you're gonna wanna pick up your laptop and um, you know just here's all the all the ports and you just wanna get your compressed air and um, just blow into that, loosen up any dust or hairs that could have accumulated into there. And um, if you don't have compressed air, you can also use a uh, a very very soft paintbrush, and you know just gently go in there and knock off all the um, all the crap that's stuck in there. So there you go, guys. I really hope that this uh, video was informative for you guys. Hopefully, um, I taught you on how to properly clean your laptop. And if I did, please like this video, leave a comment, and subscribe. Later.